Death by UFO, Captain Thomas Mantell. Around midday on the 7th of January, 1948, people in Kentucky reported a massive object in the sky. This object was up to 300 feet wide and descriptions of the object include ice cream cone and teardrop shaped. changing in colour from red topped to metallic to an almost fluid, watery transparency. Credible witnesses include the tower operator of Godman Airfield, several other senior officers of the base, the base intelligence officer and the base commanding officer himself, Colonel Hicks. This object was watched as it silently drifted around the Kentucky skies for two hours. It was witnessed sometimes stopping, hovering and rotating. After two or so hours of reports, a flight of F-51 Mustang fighters were returning to the airbase. The flight commander, Captain Thomas Mantell, was asked to investigate. Of the flight of four F-51s initially sent to investigate, one was low on fuel and returned to base, and later one pilot became disorientated and was accompanied back to base with the third pilot, leaving only Thomas Mantell to pursue the unidentified object. At around 15,000 feet, Mantell radioed in to say the object was in sight, it was moving at about half his airspeed, and it was tremendous in size. As he continued to climb, he radioed in saying he was closing in on the object and this was the last time anyone heard from Mantell. He had been chasing the object for over 30 minutes and by 3.15 there was no visual or radio contact with Mantell. A search was launched and the wreckage of his F-51 Mustang was found 130 miles from Godman Airfield. Amongst the wreckage, Mantell's watch was found. It had stopped at 3.18. With this first recorded death linked to a UFO, investigations into the phenomena suddenly grew more serious. Whether the crash was caused by pilot error, mechanical malfunction or by the UFO remains unclear.